What's going on church fam? It's Church Life bringing y'all another video. So today's title, don't turn back to what's hurting you when the heavenly father set you free. Let's get into it. Don't let guilt keep you in a place of sin. Sometimes the enemy will use how we feel about ourselves to keep us in a dark place. And sometimes it's that shame that calls us to keep turning back to the very thing that hurt us because we may feel like that's all we deserve. But the devil is a lie and the truth ain't in him. See, one of the most powerful things that the Heavenly Father taught me is this. It's impossible to heal from something that you keep returning back to. See, the enemy wants you to live in that pain that comes from sin, but the Heavenly Father wants to deliver you out of it. That's why one of the greatest gifts we could receive from the Heavenly Father here on earth is a renewed mind that was provided for us through Lord Jesus, because that's how we be set apart from the world. See, when you start thinking from the newness of life, it will affect everything about you, how you speak, how you treat others, including yourself. And you will gain a certain type of confidence that only the Heavenly Father can give you through Lord Jesus. And that's the same confidence you need in order to view things differently so that you may serve the Heavenly Father more efficiently through obedience. And that's how you live in the abundance of God. The devil don't want you to gain access to the truth that's in the scripture because the moment you begin to live in the Holy Spirit of God, you will begin to put away the old man and become a new creature in Christ. The devil can only tamper with the things that keep us connected to the world. So when we begin to let go of the world and live in the spirit by having faith in Lord Jesus, that's what set us free from captivity. So the more you let go of worldly things, the less power the enemy has over your life. That's why today I pray that you don't turn back to what's keeping you in bondage when the Heavenly Father deliver you out of whatever you're struggling with. May you be set free. I pray this bless you in Jesus name. Amen.